Notice how they invite others into that group for that mission. Now the whole, all their, all their fans are part of that mission to win. What's their vision for how that's going to happen? Working together. Working together. Good. And then you could come up with a whole bunch of other visions for how they're going to win. Strategic visions, okay? Like they're going to use this particular type of play more often, okay? Or they're going to play, you know, the, this combination of players together, okay? I'm a big, okay, so I'm from, I'm from upstate New York originally, all right? So I am a Mets fan. I know. <laughs> Try not to judge, okay? But I'm very happy right now because the Mets won last night, all right? And their mission, okay, is to win. And their vision this year for how to do that includes good pitching, and they got some more bats, okay, more hitters. So vision in includes some strategic things that you can, can take, that take flesh, make flesh of the mission, all right? So the vision here, work together. How does LeBron, in this case, as a leader, how does he lead? What's his, how does he express his passion? <clears throat> I like that. <laughs> so, his motivation comes from within. We always say, yeah, you know, athletes' motivation comes from within. But you're saying, yeah, but he also uses city as motivation. And he says, look, that's, there it is. I'm going to draw on that. That's really important, at least in my, in my profession, in ministry, to always look to, um, to always pay attention to your community and say, hey, I might have all sorts of great ideas but my motivation is in front of me. That's my motivation. Thank you.